Welcome to another video. Today I will be opening some things that I got from AmiAmi. It's not a lot, but I am, as always, excited to open them. Let's get started. So even though I didn't get that many stuff, I think this is a proper time to kind of advise against something. Um, this is uh, just AmiAmi's card. It's very beautiful as always. I ordered this around October, so um, it barely arrived to me. It was late October, I believe. So this is their October card, and I'm glad that I got a chance to get it because it is very pretty. And then these are clear files that I bought. So with clear files, um, it's great that they put them against some cardboard so they're protected. But as you can see, I only really bought three other things, and yet they still sent it in a box as big. I don't really know if AmiAmi even sends things in bubble mailers, which would have been much cheaper, and the shipping I'm sure would have been cheaper had they done that. Um, so just a word of caution if you plan to buy only a few things from AmiAmi. The shipping for this package wasn't that much, but you know, it's never wrong or bad to try and steer away from large shipping costs because then you're pretty much paying double for the price of your items and you know, no one ever wants to do that. So that's it. Let's get to opening these things. So these are clear files and hopefully I have enough room to open these. This is kind of a big cardboard. Um, I don't believe they're this long, honestly. <laughs> and I'm glad they, they protect your things, but you know. So I got two, and I'm gonna use that to mail other stuff, so at least there's that. The first one that I bought, I, actually I can introduce both of them because they're part of the same set. So Yuri on Ice, which is a figure skating anime that I'm really into right now is having a collaboration with Sanrio and I pre-ordered the little plushies. I mean the plush that looks like this. I pre-ordered this one and that one but these are the clear files in the same theme and I've ordered a couple stuff from this series because it's really cute. I love love Yuri as Pachako and I absolutely adore Victor as Pom Pom Purin. So this is I believe an A7, A7 size which means it's, it's about 11 and a half inches by eight and a half. It's the largest size for a clear file as far as I know. But I absolutely love these things. Not only are they great for display just because of the picture and it's not a piece of paper like a poster so they last forever, but you can also use them for things. Before I toss this over, here's another look at AmiAmi's card and then the back has their information if you want to shop with them. Awesome store. The next thing is this Yuri on Ice with the Sanrio theme going on. Another collaboration. This is tape, washi tape. And I'm not usually someone to buy washi tape simply because I probably would use it, but I don't need it. <laughs> I could just use regular tape. Hopefully you can see the cute little design on the tape. So it has all three of the characters because they are theming this after Sanrio characters, so Yuri is Pachako, um, Victor is Pom Pom Purin, and I believe Yuri, the other one that I don't really care for. <laughs> Who is he supposed to be? I think Hello Kitty? Yep, there he is. So this is really cute tape. The next item that I bought is this keychain. It's a rubber strap and it has both Victor and Yuri, and these are really hard to come by. They make a lot of merchandise for both Yuri and Victor, but the ones that have them together, which is how it should be if you've watched the series, um, they don't make as much. So I'm really happy that I got this one because it's so cute. Look at his eyes, <laughs> the little beady eyes. And it's a good size. Here's the rubber strap up close. It comes with a dust plug, solid blue with licensing on the back. It's so cute. I love it. <laughs> then it has all this Yuri on Ice licensing. Very cute. Oh, so adorable. Okay, enough with the gushing on that one. The next thing I'm pulling out of this bag is this Hitalia keychain. As I've mentioned with previous videos, Hitalia is recently getting a splurge of new merchandise and I am so excited for it. Um, most of it I don't really care for because it's the same picture over and over again, but Chibi Talia was one of the first characters that I absolutely loved. I made a pinata for her, or him, <laughs> him technically, like twice. <laughs> That's how much I love Chibi Talia. But they don't get that much merchandise. So cute. And it's a really good size. I believe this is the three inch, two to three inch size. And I already have a couple of these, so they're gonna look awesome on my corkboard. 
the last two things are equally as exciting. Oh my goodness, they made plushies of the characters. And Hatalia already had some plushies for sale. Um, they've been discontinued for the longest time though. And I absolutely will not pay the price that they go for now. <laughs> Both of my characters, favorite characters, are really expensive. So I was really happy when they made these kind of keychain sized plushies of them in this style. The style's okay. I don't really care for it all that much. It doesn't make them cuter. It doesn't make them any less cute. And it's by... Who is this? Is it Gift? I know they make those other plushies. Hmm. It's just Takara Tommy Arts. Okay. But anyway, so these plushies are really cute. Let's open Russia. You know what? I'll open America. Let's open America. So there he is. He's got the embroidery all over his eyes and facial structure, as well as... No, the outfit is actually just printed on. It's not embroidered. The details are not embroidered. So his coat is really simplified. He does not have the little airplane symbol on the side, but he does have the star, so that's cute. Where's his ahoge? Ah, they put it in the wrong place. That's supposed to be down here. <laughs> okay. Well, that works, I guess. He's not very soft, but he he's not rough, which is great. And um, some of the texture that you f you see on felt plushies are very rough, but he's so cute and a really good size to hang up. So I'm excited to hang him up in my display for Russia and America that I have going on. And then here is Russia. I'm not going to open him yet. I'm going to open him once I hang him up for reasons. So his hair is kind of folded over. The details on his coat are not embroidered either. They're just printed on, but then he has his scarf. That's so cute. And he does have his medal. Oh, that's, this is so cute. I absolutely love it. I love these. And then let's get one more good clear look at the tag. So this is by, I don't know. I don't know who this is by. Just Takara Tommy Arts. Thank you, Takara Tommy Arts, for making these. I hope they get more plushies in the future. Maybe a gift one? I would love a gift one. And I'm really hoping that America is next in line for the Nendoroid, because I know England just got announced. And as much as I don't like him, I'm going to have to buy him because I want them to see a reason to make America. And maybe go as far as Russia. And there's my little Ami Ami haul. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.